week's episode was split, I'd say around about three. It, it had about three focuses in this week of uh, The Walking Dead. Um, going going from talking about um, how going from us talking about how Rick Rick is still actually very very weak 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 and uh, he's still and pretty much he's trying to uh, regain his strength. Um, and as the episode kind of carried on, he was actually trapped. Uh, he actually was trapped in his own home or pretty much the house that. Uh, that uh, he had been occupying, he he was he was he was trapped in there with these weird motorcycle dudes who pretty much just kind of just went in to scavenge the place. And Rick pretty much did honestly kind of prove that uh, he still has um, uh, some power, or pretty much he still kind of has has enough strength to 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 uh, to stealthily take out one of the guys and pretty much. Um, uh, escape his house. Then cutting off. Uh, then cutting over. We have the Carl and uh, Michonne thing of pretty much of them trying of uh, both of the characters bonding and going uh, and going through the whole thing of her telling him about her past and what happened with her son and everything. And pretty much we do kind of have all these quaint and keen little moments of them. Going over, going over how Carl feels and something, and pretty much um, uh, how um, and pretty much how uh, he's handling, or what he believes leaves is um uh, the is uh the death of Judith and uh and uh and trying to comfort Michonne, pretty much become a good 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 friend for her, you know, even though Michonne is actually way more bond heavy with um with Rick and Carl anyway so that's kind of a thing there or pretty much she opens up way more to those two more than 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 practically everybody else so pretty much she she she's only had a chance to and we do kind of have a few moments with that with when um uh, with her which would which would happen last week of or at least like 2 weeks ago of her coming out and breaking through the through, through, through uh, the shell you do actually kind of see that in this uh, in this episode um especially when especially when like uh, she goes into uh, the pink suicide room and wish that and wish that the entire family the mother father possibly the aunt or possibly the grandmother um uh, and the kids were all lying in the bed bullet holes in their head that that and you know she kind of had a human moment there then going on from that, we do have the Glenn and Tara, and now uh, and now with the Eugene Abraham and uh, Rosita moments from, and and a lot of these characters, or at least like I didn't mention this last week, but but like all three of these characters, they kind of they kind of follow the same path line as what they had in the comics, or pretty much some sort of like that. I know, I'm, I'm not necessarily sure how far that they're going to take it, but but um, how it's going for this one, we do have the thing of of Eugene saying that uh, he knows how to save uh, the world and he needs to get to Washington, and Abraham being really really desperate and trying to get Glenn and Tara Tara to to up and uh, to up and stay um, uh, to stay with them. We really didn't get too much from a uh, from a uh, from a uh, Rosita. The only the only real thing that uh, well, we know about Eugene is just, uh, is that he's a scientist. He's he's really really smart, and he can't handle a gun to save his life. That's kind of the only thing. Everybody else, on the other hand, can pretty much take care of themselves, and they can hold their own. Aside from aside from Abraham being really really really. Or at least him being a little bit too open with, with his ideas about how, about about how he can uh, about about how he thinks that Glenn should stay with them, and that going off to try and find Maggie is like a is like a pointless endeavor, and pretty much he shouldn't do it. Aside from all of that, really, you know, this episode, if it, it did actually kind of like say like well now well 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 now yeah Rick and Rick and everybody else are pot um, uh, are following the train track same way same as um uh, Ty Reese and Carol and everybody else and they're all heading off to um uh, this mystery place now 
Um, well, now that's our second group group which has headed off that um, uh, area. Not necessarily everybody else, but but there is a good good chance that most of them possibly might might find their way to this to this next area, or possibly this. Or possibly they possibly might run into the train tracks, or they might run, run, run into this place on uh, the road. So Daryl and uh, everybody, uh, or so, 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 getting into uh, the preview and the sneak peek from next week, it seems as though as that, um, it seems as that from uh, the, the uh, previews, our next episode is really going to focus around Daryl and Daryl and Beth. So that is kind of a so pretty much that is kind a uh, kind of a plus to pretty much see what the, what these two are going to do. So that's kind of so that is something that that is keeping my uh, my uh, my hopes up for the moment. So yeah, I'll see you guys on on uh, on the next John Grave show. Please keep watching anime. Keep keep playing video games. I'm out. Nay, hey, Walking Dead. Hey, it's 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 getting there. It's getting there. I mean, like, not in terms of quality, but, but like, but like in terms of it's getting there into which that, uh, into which that, um, we're, we're slowly getting our characters back, um, um, together. So, so, um, uh, there is a possible chance of that, and I'll keep a hope out for it. So, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. I'm out.